Hi, y'all. Casey here for a new episode of Today I Learned. Make sure you stick around for this episode to learn some pretty tasty myths most of us learned in school. Did you know that the tongue map most of us learned in health class that taught us which parts of the tongue sense which kinds of taste is a total myth? In case you aren't familiar, many kids are taught in elementary school that the tongue is divided into four sections that can sense only one of four separate tastes, sweet, salty, sour, and bitter. The tongue map was inspired by a 1901 paper written by a German scientist. The problem wasn't that his research was wrong, but a misinterpreted drawing which diagrammed his findings was used in the 1940s and reimagined by a Harvard philosophy professor who included it in his book. Sensation and Perception in the History of Experimental Psychology, and thus we have the tongue map. This map has been refuted repeatedly over the past 50 years or so, since the breakthrough realization that this wasn't true in a 1974 study, but it is still taught in schools as legitimate health science. So then how does taste work? Well, your tongue has about 10,000 taste buds and they are replaced about every two weeks. Also, there are no areas that sense only specific tastes. All areas of the tongue sense taste about the same, but the outer edges of the tongue are more sensitive to taste in general than the middle area. Taste also isn't exclusive to the mouth. There are other senses that also contribute to tasting like scent, texture, and temperature. As research has told us more about taste, we've also learned that there is a fifth taste. The basic tastes are sweet, which is caused by sugar or glucose and its derivatives. Salty is caused by table salt, which is made of crystals consisting of sodium and chloride, but salty can also be sensed through mineral salts that contain potassium or magnesium. The sour taste comes from acidic solutions, but the sensation of sour is actually caused by hydrogen ions. Bitter is quite a bit more complex, and there are 35 different proteins that sense and react to bitter things. This is an evolutionary and survival response to protect us from ingesting things that are toxic to us. Finally, there is savory, also known as umami, which tastes like meat broth and is caused by glutamic or asparagic acid. If you learned a bittersweet truth today, make sure you smash that like button and subscribe. Join me next time when I'll explain the connection between Scientology, a poisoned apple, and the purge. Don't forget to stand up and use your voice, and I will see you heathens later. Bye, y'all.